Hi guys. One question that appears from time to time is about the docker that comes with Apollo OS distro. The Apollo OS distro uses Doppler's Magellan as our uh, workbench replacement and the docker is also part of Doppel's Magellan. Well, to edit is it's more or less simple. You guys need first to click the left control mouse, the uh, left control, the keyboard control key, the left one, like this, and then click on the docker. Okay. The left keyboard button, the control, okay, and press on the docker that you want to edit. A little blue bar, vertical bar will appear, that means that we are now in edit mode. So now I can do whatever I want with it, I can position the docker wherever I wish, okay, or I can edit. For edit, you just need to right click on it with the mouse and edit okay it will show up my editing my editor window okay i can add more columns more rows and for each one i can configure it the way i want uh, with the function that i i pretend for example i want to <coughs> change the icon from from uh, this one here image for example pepe pep no pause I don't know what it is so for example this one yes now I have changed it okay to change the function or edit the function edit function it will show me the function that is programmed okay so to remove it completely you just need to right click again and close so no more docker but for the system to assume it you need you guys need to save and for that, you go to settings and save layout. Okay. Now, in the next reboot, this Docker will no longer show up. I will show you reboot. So, there's no Docker. No more. The same is true to configure the start button. The same is true. Left, uh, left keyboard, control key, and click on it on the button. And now I can do whatever I want. I'm not sure if you guys want to remove it because it has so many functions. Well, it's up to you guys. Okay. Now there are other possibilities to replace <coughs> the Apollo OS docker. The first one is the one that comes also with the Apollo OS or ours and is it's placing tools and is called Boeing icon bar. Okay. To it to run at boot time you guys have to put it inside the folder workbench startup like this okay and next time you boot the system it will show up a little nice docker <coughs> so okay in this case i have to configure it 
the way I want it. In this case, it's configured only if, if I push the mouse down to the Docker place, then it will show up. Okay, but I can configure it also and tell it that I want to show the Docker right after boot without pushing the mouse button, the, the mouse <coughs> down. For that, right click over the icon information and now you have a bunch of tool types for this case i want to put static to one like this save and now if i reboot it should show up <coughs> And there it is. So a little nice talker. In this case, I have only two items because this was only for a test. But I can add more um, programs or whatever to the Docker. For that, I need to go to Apollo OS, press, and in this icon here, Boeing icon bar, I can add more programs in this case I have already had only for test games and programs okay but it's very simple for example add music for example music add and now <coughs> in this subtype item I will add my program my music programs volumes stuff music uh, Eagle Player. Then I select the Eagle Player program. Okay, save. Okay. Now I have, in this case, three sub dockers: one for the games, one for the programs, and the amp, one for the music Eagle Player. Like this. Games. So this is one possibility. I like this locker because it has a really nice animation that I can scroll up and down. Pip, pip, pip. Very nice. Okay, no, but there are there is another possibility for docker replacements. So first let me remove this from Program startup and delete. Yes, press it. Do it all. So it's it's fine. <coughs> Second possibility is using the well, workbench doc two. Workbench doc two. Let me check the version. Version version. Workbench Doc 2 from Thomas Rapp. <coughs> Amazing, Thomas Rapp. And it works also pretty well with, with uh, Apollo S arrows. In this case, with this one here. Okay, just a question of configuring it the way you guys want. This one has a nice Features also. Where is it? Add item. Uh, not here, but in the installation folder from WordPress Talk 2 apps. Okay, you can add a CPU, CPU meter. What else? You can add a time clock there, also nice. So, yeah, skin pattern sweater. Oh, it's 
pretty much conf configurable. It's up to you guys. Quit, then we have Funny Dog. That is also nice. So it's also a possibility. And I see some problems there. It's just a question of configuration. Okay. So, just a warning. If you guys select a different karma, or every time you guys select a karma, your Boca, your um, work, uh, your um, default uh, Boca will also will always appear. Okay. So this Boca will always show up every time you select a new karma. Okay. And back to the default. Karma. <coughs> and as you see, the docker will show up again. So, to edit, don't forget, first, first click, uh, first pe press the left control key, the keyboard left control key, like this click with the mouse and you are on edit mode every time you make a change for example now i want to position my bar i don't know here every time you make a change you guys need to go to settings and save layout okay if i reboot the vampire this docker now will show where i left it Okay, guys, have a nice day. If you have questions, ask them. Bye-bye.